Hi, welcome to the tutorial. <clears throat> this one is about what do you do if you want to start with Arch Merged. You're ready to go to phase two, three and four. Well, um, we have several sites now. So we have this home the forum with the Arch Merge info and the Arch Merge. This one is going to be about releases. And we're going to go there because if you want to install Arch Merge, you need to download something. You go to SourceForge, and if SourceForge is not too fast, fast enough for you, you can always tell them to go somewhere else, so to go to a server that's nearby you, and you download this one, the Arch Merged version. Why with a D? It's all explained here, and on other places as well. That Arch Merge is the one that's the big one. That's the one with three desktops, and this one has no desktop. So the phase two, three, four means you don't have anything. You don't have, well, anything. You have no desktop, no applications whatsoever, and you decide. And it's all up here what you're gonna be able to decide in the future. So you decide to have the awesome desktop or the LXDE or the Plasma and so on. So on. this time we're gonna use this one. We're gonna install that one. Not particularly this look, but we're going to install i3. What's next? Next is figuring out how to install it. So you go to the installation and say, okay, what should I know? What should I read? And you check out what to do. And here's your tutorial, how to install Arch Merged. A lot of information here. So if you install it, the first thing you do is a mirror and then you check out if you can update it. That's what this is. Next up is a pr proposal is very interesting and I can only recommend it to you to start using GitHub. Why? Because we would like to you to share your files with us. What I, do I mean? I mean that I provide you now with a skeleton, with a, a full desktop actually, but you can change these things. There's no distro out there that's 100% suitable for you, nowhere. So what do you do? You download these scripts and you say look eric you're going to install what is it catfish don't want that put the hashtag in front here and it won't be installed i don't want gnome screenshot put the hashtag here it won't be installed so you can make your own system on the basis of this what i call a skeleton this is our amd budgie skeleton and the same applies with amd i3 it has a skeleton and it looks very fam familiar or the same, almost the same than the other one, but it's going to install another desktop. So it's up to you to decide if you want to use GitHub because um, it's, it can be used for backup and all that. You check out this article. If you done that, you can go to the budget gallery, budget articles, i3 gallery, IT articles. So, a little bit structured, a little bit the same. Um, this here we'll find more tutorials, but there are no tutorials yet, so we are in the process of writing this article and writing all the articles. But then it's up to you as an example. You go to the budget articles and I'll number them just the same. So you start with the gallery, installation, two, three, and so on and so on. And we install and uh, fine tune and tweak our i3. That's what will be, we will be populating this part with uh, articles and videos. Okay, so that's how to proceed each time any possible uh, desktop will have, we'll do it always in the same manner. All right, bye.